may ask yourself, hey Eric, so why is this video so important? Well, with AI videos, and more importantly, lip sync AI videos taking off, wait, what? You need to have good looking, realistic, talking head images. Images like these. Click the links in the description. And so that's exactly what I'm gonna show you in this video today. That was amazing. Today I'm gonna give you a powerful prompt generator that will create some of the best podcast style images you've ever seen. But what takes this to the next level is gonna be the creativity. Wow, this is so incredible. Hey guys, guys. You have to subscribe to Metrics Mule, like for real. And how this prompt will make ChatGPT provide us with some incredible and impressive characteristics Thank like you. Netflix, HBO, cyberpunk, and documentary style podcast images. So to start, you have to see everything I got from this prompt generator in this full chat right here. Now instantly, you could see the first five highly detailed prompts I got from Netflix original documentary style to HBO prestige drama style the list goes on. And then finally, ChatGPT will provide you with a stylistic mega pack of all of these amazing looking podcast style AI images. And then when you really want to take things to the next level, you can get even more extreme realism like I'm showing you right here from this chat, including a 10x enhanced prompt. I'm going to show you exactly what to do to get some of the best AI podcast style images that you're ever going to get. And then finally, since we are focused on AI video and all the rave right now are going to be those Jason style ones. You can even instruct it to give you a specific cinematic video, Jason nested style. These are going to be so important for you to generate good looking lip sync and realistic looking videos. And so specifically, what is the first thing we're going to do now today? What I'm going to do is I'm going to give you two amazing prompt generators. These are going to be meta prompt generators that you can use over and over again. And so the prompts I'm specifically sharing today, and in fact, all of my YouTube videos are always available 100% completely for free via the links in the description. But just to quickly show you how good of a job these are actually going to do, let me go over here into my prompts portal database. Now, in order to find these podcast style prompts, if you do have access to any of these databases, this one will be in the prompts portal, specifically in the AI influencers slash podcast one. If I open up my views and now select my podcast images, it's now filtered to only show just those and all the way to single person or multiple people. That way you can even have two talking heads in one video. Now, the common thing about all of these images are that they're going to look very realistic and that's kudos to the actual prompt. But not only that, it's going to be kudos to the actual hidden tokens that are being instructed to be used in the actual prompts themselves. And so what exactly do I mean by secret tokens? Well, secret tokens are going to be a specific keyword that you can use at the very start of your prompt. Now, I say start of your prompt because according to a lot of AIs and even Midjourney, the words that carry the most weight or have the most high level of importance are going to be the first five to 11 words that you use. So for an example, let's say in this image right here. Okay. I think it does look very realistic. Now, the reason why is because I put this token at the very start of my prompt followed by my colon and then the actual subject. Now, when you utilize these secret tokens, you can see that you don't need a long and drawn out prompt. It's going to be just a simple subject, but that secret token is going to carry so much weight and do so much of the work for you. Now, if you want to just do a quick demonstration, you can see I just did a quick flyby and I just created an image with only this token and nothing else. You'll be surprised at what the AI would just go ahead and generate. So that's exactly what I mean by a token. And that is where these prompt generators are going to give you the exact ones that you specifically need. So again, I'm going to go ahead and give you two. Let's go ahead and start with this first one. And then I'll show you the second one, which is actually going to be way better because in in the second prompt generator I'm going to give you, I specifically instruct the LLM to really make the main focus secret tokens. So now what you want to do is go ahead and copy this first one here, come into any LLM. I'll be using chat GPT today really to test out exactly how five works with these prompt generators. Now go ahead and submit the full prompt and you can see right down here below. All you have to do now 
what subject would you like to see in the podcast studio? So just very quickly describe the sort of person, or you can even use the sort of people, plural. So to start, let's go ahead and now just describe the person we want in our first one. Now, again, I basically put in a prompt below, just 24 year old influencer in a gaming studio for live streaming blonde hair, blue eyes. Now, again, yeah, obviously I can create an image from any sort of a prompt and that will work, but you won't get that level of realism specifically with those cameras mentioned and specific lenses like this right here. Look at this shot on Leica SL2 plus 75 millimeter Noctilux shallow depth of field with soft fall off split tone teal amber grading subtle rim light catching her hair. Wow. I mean, even for me, those are all words I wouldn't have thought of off the top of my head. Okay. So now with this prompt now look at this right away. This prompt, the generator, instructs ChatGPT to not give me one, not give me two or three, but we're going to get five instant prompts. And you can see from the first one, Netflix original documentary, HBO, Vibrant, Vintage, and then ultra crisp commercial advertising. So what we want to do is let's just go ahead and copy and paste a few of these. I'll go ahead and do that right now. I like to use a series of all different ones. So for today, we're going to be using my top three favorites. Now, earlier today, utilizing the same exact prompt generator, the style and uniqueness of these images are fantastic. Look at this one over here on free pick. If I go back over into Leonardo AI, you could see the ones I've been getting up here at the very top as well, more of a professionally lit sort of a studio environment. All fantastic. Now, the first one we just got with our mid journey one is already done. Look how good these actually look. Now, again, very impressed with the style and level of realism. Now, if I wanted to make sure that this was forward facing, I would go back over here in the chat GPT and I could actually say down here below at the bottom, I can say down here below, provide the prompts again, but make sure the woman is looking into the camera. And now just like that, Look, it's going to do it again. I still get the same Leica camera. Let's go ahead and copy this one and now regenerate this and see if it actually did follow the instruction. Now, while this one is waiting, let's go back over here into our chat. Scroll all the way down to the bottom. Now, one thing I always do say is to always make sure you pay attention to the follow-up question that you're going to get from, in this case, chat GPT. The reason why is because it says I can now give you another five styles where she's looking into the camera, but with more experimental cinematic looks like cyberpunk and these other ones. So let's go ahead and say yes, more with experimental. And I'll go ahead and actually add a few other words as well. For example, unique looks, modern and vibrant. So now just like that, we're going to get five more. Okay. There's the cyberpunk one and it's going to go ahead and give us five all together. Now let's go back to our first prompt. And now there she is looking right into the camera. Perfect for an AI video. Now let's say I like this one. Look how good this will look if I select low motion and then convert this into a video. Look how good she actually turned out when I converted this to a low motion video. Okay. So that is the first prompt generator. Now let's go ahead with the second one because I actually did save the best for last. Now for the second one, we're going to go back into my prompt generators database. It's going to be specific for AI images. And now here it is right here. You can see it's called extreme realism podcast meta generator. Again, let's go ahead and copy the whole thing here back in the chat GPT, brand new chat open. Now paste in this full prompt right here. Now, again, remember, we're instantly going to get our five default styles, the same ones we got before. But one of the most important things that this has instructions for is to really and specifically focus on those specific realistic looking tokens, lenses and lighting. So these should generate even better versions. So to stay consistent, let's use the same details we made for the first one. But now this time, let's paste that one. But now let's do another one. And now that way we can have two people in the same image. Now, what I did was just kind of change it up. Two women, both 24 years old. One has blonde hair and one is Asian descent with light hazel eyes. Now, instantly, we're going to get these five prompts. And now again, we're going to go from the ultra real Netflix all the way down to these other ones. And it's still going. Now, you can notice that these are actually going to be a little bit longer. And now look at these four in mid journey. 
these also did a phenomenal job. But now to quickly wrap things up, what if you have a specific look yourself? All you have to do is provide a simple instruction and you'll get the same style of a prompt, including those secret meta tokens. So check this out. I'm going to go ahead and scroll all the way to the bottom. And now remember, always pay attention to that last follow up. But now this time, watch what I'm going to go ahead and do. For this one, I'm going to go specifically to my scenery architecture ones because I'm going to open up and download an image like this. And now this time, I want to generate a style of a podcast image, but utilizing that same style of the image I just downloaded. I'm going to click and drop that image right there into the prompt box. And now I'm going to instruct ChatGPT to provide me with those podcast style images, but I want it to fit the style of my image I just used. So to do that, this is all you have to say. So what I said was now create more, but in this style of the image I just uploaded, I want this style, but you can add your own twist to make it even better. So now it should inspect the image, this one right here, of that cool looking neon studio, and now generate five more prompts where I can now generate those images. And now it should match somewhat similar to this one, even though I did give it permission to still do it a little bit differently if it wanted to. But look, just like that, it's going to work. And now it's going to go ahead and give me exactly what I want. And now let's take a look at what these turned out to be. And now there you have it. Two amazing prompt generators specifically for AI image podcast. And remember, if you like this video, please do hit that subscribe button. But until then, I'll see you next time.